In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to check who has access to your files in OneDrive. This process is pretty straightforward, but let's take it step by step to make sure everything is clear. First, you'll want to start by navigating to the Microsoft account page. This is your gateway to accessing the various Microsoft services, including OneDrive. You can easily find this by typing in the Microsoft account URL in your browser. Once you're there, you'll need to log in if you haven't already. Make sure you're using the credentials associated with your OneDrive account to ensure you're accessing the right files. Now that you're on the Microsoft account page, direct your attention to the upper left corner where you'll find the app launcher icon. It's the small grid of dots, it can sometimes be easy to miss if you don't know what you're looking for. Clicking on it will reveal a drop down menu listing all your available apps. From this menu, select OneDrive. If you use OneDrive frequently, it might appear near the top of the list. Upon entering OneDrive, you'll want to focus on the top navigation bar where you'll find the shared icon. Click on this and then choose the option labelled by you. What you're doing here is filtering out all the files that you have shared with others as opposed to those that have been shared with you. Once that's done, you'll see a list of files and folders that have been shared with others. Choose a file or folder from this list by clicking on it. If it's a folder, you'll be checking access to all the files it contains. After selecting your file or folder, look for the Manage Access option, which you should be able to find on the menu bar or as part of a drop down under the file options. Clicking on Manage Access will display a detailed list of people who currently have access to your file. Alternatively, if you want to examine specific files, click on My Files on the left hand navigation pane. In the Files view, you'll notice a Sharing column. Each file in this column that is labelled as shared indicates that it has been shared with others. Clicking on one of these shared files will give you a similar manage access or shared tab. By following any of these paths to manage access, you'll effortlessly see who can view or edit your files and you can adjust settings as needed to maintain your privacy or collaboration needs. That wraps up our tutorial for today. Hope you found this video helpful in managing your OneDrive file access with peace of mind.